<laughs> folks it's saturday night welcome aboard welcome to murder hobo inc we're glad to have you uh tonight we're doing a one shot uh we had to pare it down a little bit we've got three players we could have had four but the fourth one was going to be blake and that is not like dealing with us tonight so fuck it. we'll just go with three uh one of our three two, two of the faces you should find very familiar one of them is brand new to D D, and he's going to play tonight Poor bastard. <laughs> uh, you know the drill, folks. Follow us on Twitch. Follow us on Twitter. Take a look at our YouTube archive. If you want to buy some uh, really classy shit, uh, it's on one of my shoulders. I don't know which. Uh, on my other shoulder is the map of what we're going to play. But before we get into that, let's go ahead and introduce people. Ashton, we're going to make you last. That way you can see how these other two clowns do it. First off, Kyle. Kyle, who are you playing tonight and who are you? Playing plants versus zombies right now. Ask me again later. That's <laughs> awesome. I love that answer, you dick. Uh, Carol, you're up. Who are you? Who are you playing tonight? Hi, I'm Carol. Hey, everybody talking over me? Okay, good, good, good. So, hi. Oh, I'm oh, oh no, 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 wait. Hang on. My audio just came back. <laughs> Blake, go away. You're not playing tonight. I don't know why, but you're not playing tonight. Uh, hi, so my name is Carol. Uh, I'm um, a mini painter, D and D player, uh, and tonight I will be bringing back my my favorite rogue, Rania, the uh, <clears throat> let's see, the thrill seeking uh, rogue who will try anything once. We've got our quarters lined up for that. Uh, <laughs> Kyle, are, are, are you done? Can we interrupt your fucking game to play in our game? Uh, oh my gosh, let me exit. Okay, hold there on. There are zombies on your lawn. Okay, hi, I'm Kyle, and I normally play um, someone. I don't know, I've been in a while. Tonight, I'm going to be playing uh, Boom Doo, uh, uh, the artificer with only one arm. <laughs> Everything else is a prosthetic limb because I lost them. <coughs> Luckily, I still have thumb and pinky. Hey, the question is, did you blow them off yourself? Well, how do hey, you, hey, hey. you end it up? Mature in the audiences only. <laughs> hey, that wasn't a mature. All right, well, am I done? Can I play Plants vs. Zombies? Again? You can go back to Plants vs. Right. Zombies. Uh, Ashton, new guy. Welcome to the freaking mix. Uh, if you try and top these two, they will torture you the entire game. But tell us who you are, tell us why you're playing, and tell us who you're playing, please. That's fine. He's the bottom anyways. So he says. So he say. So he thinks. Um, my name's Ashton. I'm playing uh, Dracos, a Dragonborn hunter. And it's my first time, so I can give you more at a latter date. Fair enough. Uh, folks, like we said, this is a one shot. Uh, we begin with these three heroes uh, running for their lives through a cobblestone tunnel. The rest of their party has been demolished. Uh, they were sent into the Fabian mountain range, into the uh, despotic dwarven kingdom that was alleged to be defunct. Uh, during their encounters, they lost the rest of their party and have now fled down a tunnel. We rejoin them injured and with some partial spell loss. Uh, it was you, a total accident. Total accident. Uh, Boomda used to have three arms when he started this adventure. <laughs> Uh, folks, uh, as you're running down the tunnel, you spy a rock pile in front of you. I will take uh, insight. Uh, or, no, I'm sorry. I will take uh, perception. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. Great, great. Good rolls to start the night. 12 on how many points I lose, which is max and only a, well, that's nine. Is the whining done? Is the whining? Yeah, done? no, it won't. Be. She ain't done yet. I, I have, I have a nice Gruyere. Like prepared the. Uh, Boomda. 
Four. Dracos. Uh, 21. Uh, Dra Dracos, as you are plunging headlong, presumably leading the group, you feel a slight breeze on your nostrils coming from the rock pile ahead. <laughs> the heck does that mean? You can share that word, but no one else knows that. Okay, so I um, make the group aware. Well, and, uh, you are new. <laughs> okay. Second game ever. It's fine. Well, that's nice of you to let Boomda and Arania uh, know. Anybody want to uh, make an observation? Sure. I'll go up to it and check it out. Maybe I'll roll better this time. I'm going to pull off my arm cannon and start blasting my way through as she does that. Hey! Okay. I step out of the way. Are, are you? He notices. Are, are you going to blast? Yes. I sidestep as well. Uh, dexterity rolls. Dracos and Rania. Uh, that one I made. That's uh, just a straight dex check. Yep. 20. Yep. 16. Yep. Uh, Boomda, your associates, your wounded associates notice you strapping on the arm cannon, no pun intended, <laughs> and they dive to the sides of the tunnel. Yeah. Give me an insight <laughs> check, Boomda. Uh, uh, 15. Uh, yeah, you'll, you'll probably be okay. Those stones will probably not ricochet back. Ah, fuck it. Blast away! <laughs> Fair enough. Uh, how much damage does your hand cannon do? Uh, 12. That's it? Hey. I can do it for a long time. I'm just going to keep blasting. Yeah, away. sure. We've heard that before. Is uh, <laughs> is this a black powder weapon or something else? Uh, it's a magical force cannon. So no smoke. No smoke. Uh, everybody roll a straight up D20, please. Uh. Oh, oh, God. Night, boys. That one. <laughs> Great. Two. 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 All three of you notice is the magical force cannon -na 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 -na, strikes the rocks. Rocks come everywhere, including right back at you. Let's see if we can kill people right off the bat. Yeah, I only have eight. Six damage. Not <laughs> All this. three of you. <laughs> Down. That takes Rainia down to two. Yep. Uh, <laughs> boom to D12 against me. Let's see how well you cleared the tunnel. Six. One. The tunnel is still chock full of debris, and the debris that did not come at you has choked the tunnel further. Care to okay. boom I keep going. Again? Keep going. <laughs> I'm going to back. I'm going to go behind him. Uh, or duck behind something. Same here. I'm going to move back and I'm just going to detach my arm and let them finish that. Dracos, what would you like to do? This. Do you have any useful, like a healing potion or anything? Mm. You or know what? I'll tell no. you. I, I will give you each a single healing potion, assuming that you used the good shit down in the tunnel fighting the serpentine basilisk. Uh, what's the healing potion? D8 D8 plus two, no ones. Now, do you want to quaff this before you move? Do you want to quaff this before boom to triggers? Do you want to just duck I'll it? Move, I will move first and then quaff. I will quaff it before you triggers. <laughs> I have uh, two hit points, guys. Uh, Dracos, Rania, D20s to get out of the way by moving behind him. Uh, I'm not stupid. I'm going to pull off the arm cannon. I disagree. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was good. No, was, I rolled eight on the healing potion. So wait, is there a plus to the healing potion? I don't remember. Two. Dose. Eight plus two. D8 it's plus still two. Okay, great. So I got ten back. <clears throat> uh, now give me your D20. Draco's D20. Thirteen. Thirteen is fine. All right, so no plus to this? Nope. That's not going to be good either. Four. 
<laughs> Rainia chugs the potion but trips over a piece of debris and trips as Boomda detaches his arm and cranks yet another one off. Uh, advantage for Dracos and Boomda. Straight up dex roll for Rainia. 13. Wow, this is just terrible. Nope. That says I've got a good dex, but I mean, I can't help when I'm rolling under five for every freaking roll. Uh, seven. Yikes. Dracos? 26. Uh, Dracos and Boom to stick their fingers in their ears. Well, Boom oh. sticks one finger in okay. one ear. So you just reach around. And uh, they dive for cover like uh, Prince Voltan <laughs> and the Hawkmen. Uh, Rainia quaffs oh, her potion die. and trips. <laughs> uh, give me a dex, or that was your dex save, wasn't it? That, you have to well, no, no, no. That, that, that was to get out yeah. of the way. Now you do your dex save. Sorry. I don't want to kill you yet. Right, let's try the other one. But I'm certainly going to try. Nope. <laughs> I'm just going to leave it in. Nope. Nope. That's freaking awful. Only three hit point damage All this right. time. As you get peppered with shotgun pellets to the back of the head. What Boom, the uh, D12 against me as the smoke begins to clear. We see how you did. 11. Dose. A clear path has been made. Although... Give me an insight check, all three of you. Could it be made bigger? I can make it bigger. Uh, okay, that's a good roll. Gee, thanks. Uh, insight? 12. What the hell's insight? Of this 18. Draco, 21. All three of you think, huh, I wonder if he's damaged the tunnel at all. <laughs> Who wants to proceed forward to what appears to be stone steps? Um, probably not me. I'm going to help people out by making the hole a bit bigger. No. Before that, I'm going to cast. No. I'm going to cast a spell of cure wounds on <laughs> Rena. Oh, uh, you don't know how this game's played. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the two sweetest members on tonight. I think he does, actually. Okay, go ahead and uh, give her the magic Eight plus four. So 12. 12. That should put me back to full. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I, I get to know. He was one spell cast. That's, that's awesome. Uh, Ashton and Reyna, straight up D20 rolls. Make sure you don't get a one or a two. Oh, God. You're asking me for that? <coughs> yep. I got a 15. That is not a one or a two. It's a three. <laughs> uh, Draco grabs a hold of the back of Reyna's hair as he sees Boomda getting the trigger mechanism ready to fire. <coughs> Gives her a yank. They all dive behind stones. Boomda sets the charge. <laughs> <laughs> Boom, Dad. This will be a very important D12 roll because you know everything behind you is blocked. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you play oh. a goblin in the party? It's a one. That's true. Why did you play a goblin? You should be a goblin. Nice. <laughs> the hole has been made much larger. Uh, and the stone... Uh, Did you say the hole is gaping now? Well, the, the tunnel is now completely its normal size. There is gravel there. A few hundred years from now, a landscaper will come by and dig all that shit out and be very great. You no, know, Kyle, what, he, what he's saying is <coughs> that sphincter is no longer able to close. Oh, uh, okay. Woo. All right. Folks, we have the peanut gallery uh, off yeah. camera. So uh, the the stairs that used to be perfectly formed are now chipped to hell. Uh, lead up in front of you. Uh, also, the dust caused from the rubble uh, is starting to waft towards you, indicating that there is a breeze coming out of the orifice. Or there's a creature breathing so heavily that it's that, breathing in. That is true. Blast again. Okay. 
All right. Well, since I feel much better now, I guess I can go take point and I will do it stealthily. Or try to, because frick, every dice rolls under a five. Anybody want to tell her what's wrong with that plan? Yeah. <laughs> I'll find out here soon. <laughs> well, so you go forward to take point? I was going to go forward down the tunnel, but I guess, no? I don't but, care what you do. <laughs> Hell, we can have this wrapped up by 8.30. <laughs> hey, hey. You do you. In the Inside seat. check. No, no, you, 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 I was going to say, if you want to let her know that Kyle's trying to fire. Oh, Kyle's going to fire? Uh, super new. <laughs> uh, super new. Radio yeah, Dracos yells out, fire in the hole. I'm a married Fair. man, Ashton. I <laughs> go. Keep blowing holes through it. I'm not going to advance until you're done. Okay. So, uh, do you want to retreat? Yeah. Okay. Pulling uh, behind him and behind whatever cover I can find. Uh, give me a straight up D20. Why? Hey, that was good. All right. Maybe it's going to finally uh, bounce out. 17. The rogue hustles up behind both Dracos and Boomda as Boomda uses his lobster claws to uh, fire the hole again. D12 for me, Sport. All right. Take it in. <laughs> yeah. The whatever was above has now crumbled down and chalked the stairway filled with rocks. Yep. I was just making sure there was a dragon on the other end of that hole. I know for certain. Uh, well, you know, I could stealth up to it and check it out. Now you can't can stealth with big rocks. No, no, no. She can stealth. <clears throat> uh, all right. Now what? Now what, genius? You're the engineer. Keep blasting. All right. Ice cream cease fire. And hope so. I think he's got it. <laughs> D12. He's going to bury us all. Uh, sunlight starts to drift in from above. All right. All right. See? I did it. I scared the dragon away. Hey, at least I'm good at climbing. Are you? Yeah, I can of course I am. Has the blasting ceased? <laughs> the blasting has ceased. Very good. Uh, Wait, hold on, hold on. It's only been 18 minutes. Let's blast three more times. <laughs> so don't you have to have a cigarette and wait a second before you can do it again? <laughs> <laughs> He's young. He's a young guy. Uh, <laughs> Boomed is done firing at the DM's <laughs> request. Radia and Dracos, what would you like to do? Beats the hell out of me now. I want to get the hell out of here. You you see Boomda fucking with his magical hand cannon, and there seems to be a problem with it. Oh, sorry, DM rule. <laughs> <laughs> the fucker's broken <laughs> now. Uh, you know what I, to think about it? I should have snuck up to it and disabled it. I mean, you know, it is a device. I could probably have disabled it. Who wants to do what? While wow, Boomda fucks with his arm. I catch my arm and go out the hole. I'm going out I'm the hole. How hard is it to get out of there, by the way? Uh, it's two floors down. Dracos, what do you want to do? Two floors down? Uh -oh. have to uh, you're two floors down, you got to go up. Uh, how crumbled are the stairs? Uh, they've seen better days, and they were dwarven made, but now they've been fucked over by a goblin. Well, now I'm going to uh, use my grapple <laughs> hook and... Toss up the stairway for extra traction. Give me a acrobatics. Let's see if you can bury your grappling hook in Rania's head. Hey! So it's uh, 18 plus 5. Uh, Rania and Boomda, you hear a <laughs> and up goes the grappling hook and uh, catches on a rock above uh sunlight is streaming in it's clearly daylight of some kind out there you've been underground for so long you've lost track uh the stairs do go up and then wind up so you can 
continue to walk out or you can Batman up the repelling hook. Your choices. I'll, I'll try Batmaning up the repelling hook after him. It is his. I'll let him go first. Dracos. I gave a strong tug before I proceed. Your 18 was sufficient to uh, catch on some debris. Oh you feel confident that even your advanced weight of a dragonborn should be okay. Up, up, and away. On the way up, you see Sammy Davis Jr., who asks what you cats are doing up there. Oh, man, what? nobody. You mean you found the candy man? No, it's the original <laughs> Batman. Every time they walk up the side of the building, somebody famous. Fuck you guys. You're all too young. Uh, Ashton, go ahead. Give me all I know is Eartha Kitt. Go, go ahead and give me a performance check, please. At, um, Dracos. Performance? Mm. Performance? We're not actually We're going to see how he's so, uh, Batman. 18. Uh, Rainier, you notice Dracos give a uh, harsh tug. Sensing that he feels it's safe, he scampers up the side of the dwarven made uh, tower and pops out of the exit above, bathed in sunlight. All right, I will follow him then. Do Go ahead I and give me a performance check. Performance to climb? Yep. yep. Uh, in order to convince your, your compatriots that it is secure. Well, I'm not trying to convince anybody of anything. I'm just trying to climb out. Yeah, I know. That's the only way I can climb. I, yeah, I, know that. I mean, I have like special things for climbing, but um, all right. That's a 12. Yeah, yeah that's good enough. Uh, you scale up the uh, uh, dwarven made walls and you are fine. Boomda, you're the last one down there. You can climb up the rope or take the stairs. Stop playing zombies. Boom hey. hey, boom, that come on. I grab oh, a rope boom, and give a tug because who leaves rope behind? I'll just hold on to it and wait for someone to pull it up. Hey, <laughs> I look at my strength and I go, that's probably not happening. I look climb at my long sword and help him. Bob, wait, 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 wait. Actually, can you legitimately not climb up before I say that? Boom, da. There's stairs. Going all the way up. <laughs> okay. With the coil of rope in your hand, I assume? Yes, just in case they decide to pull the rope up and I don't have to do as much work. Uh, Boomda is the only one that sees a sign uh, on the tower wall that says Tower Boomba. of Guest. Boomda ignores it, throws the sign down on the <laughs> ground to confuse other adventurers. <laughs> well, it's a crossroads and... Uh, well played, Boomda. Uh, what, does it does it, what does it say on it? Tower of Gist. Okay. okay. So, all three of you are bathed in the sunlight. It looks like it's mid-morning. Uh, you look around, getting the panoramic view. Ahead of you is the Fabian Mountain Range, but as you turn around... You notice uh, the Bedlow Straits, which is a waterway uh, that brushes up against Peepo, which is where you came from, and separates the mountain range. So you are on the wrong side of where you started. So now the choice is how to get back to safety, especially when you're so beat up. Let's take a nap. <clears throat> Would you like to take a short rest? Yes. But yeah, I think for them, yes. They can be coming. Are you after going to gathering, rest? What? After gathering my grapple, I take a short rest. Uh, Boomda's going to do tug of war with you, I believe. Yeah. Absolutely. Roll off on strength. Yeah. 18. 15. Yeah! Uh, Boom declaims the grappling hook is his own. Oh, I should have helped. Okay. Hey, I need as much help. How about I convince him that it would be best for me to have it as we almost nearly got encaved in the cave? Persuasion check. Or intimidation. Or intimidation if you want to be anger about it. I got a 19 plus uh, four. 23. You, you are convinced? 
he gives you the rope and grappling hook back. Uh, you have your choice. You can camp out inside the tower or outside the tower. I was thinking anybody good with survival, which I would Come inside, know. come outside as long as. Listen to what she's saying. So find a decent campsite. I can find a decent campsite for us. You are on the pinnacle of a mountain. And I can do it. I'd like to roll a survival check to find a nice place to camp. Go ahead. I think I want to go minus back three. That's a three. <laughs> <laughs> For minus a three. Of zero. zero. Yeah. You, seem, you seem to think that the tower is a suitable place to take a nap. You walk back down the stairs and throw your backpack down and get out of the sunlight. And I rolled a 16 on my survival. You would assume that the inside of the tower is the most defensible spot and probably the best spot to go ahead and camp. Oh, really? All right, I'll trust in them. Okay. Four hours later, or an hour later, however long you want to take, you are refreshed. You're basically here. I don't think I have to do that. <clears throat> well, you'll get some hit points back. No, actually, because of the heal he gave me, I get he got me back to full. Oh, okay. Uh, you God. guys can regain oh, some spells. Short rest. If you want them. Yep, short rest. Sorry, I'm slow, and I'm and trying to figure out where I'm at in the map. You're fine. The map's pretty much irrelevant because I'll change it on a whim. <laughs> don't worry too much <laughs> Yeah, no and there's no bards here, so the song of rest is out. But you can use your spell slot. Or you yeah, can still we, sing while we. He's still under arrest somewhere. God. Uh, <laughs> after your short rest, you wake up. Uh, the sun is almost to its zenith at this point in time, and I will take perception checks by all three of you. Go ahead, yeah, we'll see. <clears throat> God, all the non-combat things are going great. Perception, huh? That would be a 22. 22. Boomda and Dracos. 16. Um, I got an 8 on my perception and a 9 on my uh, hit points. Okay. Uh, add your hit points. You're good there. Uh, Rania and Boomda, you notice in the bright sunlight that there is a well-worn trail probably from centuries of... Uh, iron shod feet treading down from this tower uh, and it leads down the mountain and you safely assume that it's probably a pretty safe trail if it's that well worn. You may go down there. Currently at the pinnacle there's not a whole lot of vegetative growth and there's certainly no animals. Uh, the farther down you go uh, the more trees and uh, scrub brush will be present and probably animals if you're going to be hungry. Now we got no more rations, huh? You are really low on rations, especially water, which might be really, really important. Guys, fuck that shit. If it has to happen, we can take my last arm and I'll just make a fourth prosthetic. No. You're going to be shameless from family guy. Before. Absolutely. All, all he's no. saying is No. No boom -bacue. I bet I bet with a little mustard and brown. I, I like hashtag boom Oh I I'm sorry, but when he was mentioned, all I could think of was the walking dead when they had the barbecue. So oh, yeah. boom bacue popped in mind. Uh so do we want to take the trail or do we want to just wander aimlessly through the mountains? Oh no, we're taking that trail. Trail I'll point it out to uh trail. Boomda. I follow. Boomda. Uh, this is clearly a terrible idea, but I'll go along with it. Uh, as you venture down the trail, uh, you go about an hour. You're starting to feel the old tummy grumbling, and you notice that there are a lot more trees and brush, although it's not a full-on forest. Uh, and then, after cleaning the... Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Oh, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. Uh, 
As you go around a small curve in the trail, you come yeah, face to face with a 12 foot creature with two heads. Everybody, roll perception or initiative. Good. I think I already perceived that. Wow. Eh. Uh, nine. Wow. Eleven. Six. <laughs> <laughs> The, oh the Etten will go ahead and go first. It gets two attacks. Its first attack is going to focus on two. That would be Dracos. And three, that would be Boomda. Good. So there'll be two characters in melee with them already. Boomda red, uh, Dracos <laughs> gold. Seven. Does a 10 hit Boomda? No. Does a 22 hit Dracos? Oh. Yes. Uh, Dracos is hit. Oh, you got lucky there. Oh, plus five. Uh, seven hit points of damage. Uh, 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 next up is the 11. Right. Okay. Well, since there are two people in melee with it already, that'll give me my sneaky attack. All right, 12 so. to hit this thing. Hey. All right, so I need like six. Uh, I'm using, I have two weapon fighting, so I get two attacks. But only one of them gets the sneak attack bonus, correct? Right. One gets the, and only one of them gets uh, the modifier damage, too. Gotcha. Uh, well, the first one was a 21 to hit, so I'm sure that hits. You said it was a 12, right? Yep, easy to hit, hard to kill. All right, so 14, so that's Just two. like herpes. <laughs> so I'm using a rapier and a short sword. All right, short sword. Yep. Okay, so. Oh, uh, that's pretty. Oh, wait, and sneak attack. Mm, well, that's we get you an abacus. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like, okay, that's pretty good. So, I mean. Boomda, you're uh, up next, so you can start rolling. 15, 19, <clears throat> plus 4 is 23 points of damage. There you go. Boomda, next, followed by Dracos. Okay. I'll be right back. 18. Did you roll to attack? Did you roll to attack? To see you... uh, three lightning damage, and I turn my arm into a little shield, and I run away. <laughs> Dick, uh, Dracos, you're up as you see. Boom, uh, pull back. <coughs> pull okay, so the fight. I pull out. Thank you very much. Um, I'm going to melee attack with a horde breaker. He's not no horde breaker. He's not, he's, not, he's the one. Oh my bad, my bad. So I I uh, do the double attack. Gosh, come on, man, know the rules. Come on, Rook. <laughs> <laughs> so it's um. Jesus, you're helping people. You're being nice. You're giving them a heads up. Who the fuck are you? Get off the stage. <laughs> hey, well, I think I want to keep him over Blake. Shut up. So, um, <laughs> I, hit, so I hit with the 13 you, I really on um, Actually. three or uh, eight and eight. So 16 damage. Uh, very nice. Uh, new round, everybody. Initiative. Oh, grab. I lost my D2. Oh, there it is. 17. Oh, much better. 22. Dracos, 13. Everybody beat me. Rania, you're up. All right. So here goes my two attacks. Uh, that's nice. That's nice. That's a 22. And that's not so nice. That's so six plus six is 12. 12 hits him, though. Yep. Okay, so what is it that was, okay, D8, D6, and two Murder Hobo Ink dice. Nice, nice, nice plug. <laughs> you know what else is a nice plug? No, shut up. That's off camera, folks, never mind. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nice. 10, 11, that wasn't awesome. Four, 15. Vibrating? Points. What? Yes. Uh, 17 is up next. Boom, da. Yeah, I pull out a crossbow and I shoot him in the face. Do it. Oh, yeah. well, I didn't do a very good job of it. Uh, 
Five. Uh, Rania, a crossbow bolt whizzes past your head. Dracos. Oh, five damage. Oh, five damage. Oh, okay, because yeah. we know what the hit number is. So. Yeah. Uh, Dracos, you're up. So I'm going to dual hand attack with a hit of 16 and a 9 plus an 8 at 17. Both hit? Both hit. Woo! Roll your damage. 17 hit. To your damage? 17 damage. Oh, cool. Total 17 oh, you're, damage. You're bowing it? No, double handed. You're, it's and a D8. You can't do 17. Your, your, your dagger damage is a D4. <laughs> I got a, a 1D4 mm -hmm. plus 5. Correct. <laughs> 9. Uh -huh. No, no, no. 1D4. What did you roll? A 9. It's a D4. What's the roll on the D4? A four. Okay. Plus five. It's so nine. nine. Yeah. <laughs> it's my second dagger. But you don't get. Oh, you. Oh, yeah. You took the feet where you didn't Yeah. With the second dagger of a three plus five is eight is seventeen. Because he has. He has. So. Feet. So if I'm if I'm reading this right, this right, Rackos <laughs> knows what the fuck he's talking about. <laughs> but the guy trying to help him isn't paying attention enough to Game know. two, so baby. Game two okay. in the that's series. What I, that's, <laughs> that's what I thought. Just, hey, I, play just double check. <laughs> I play video games. I play video games. That didn't count for shit. That'll do, pig. That'll do. <laughs> uh, the, uh, awesome hit, man. Awesome hit. That's hey, I'm just fun. saying. I'm saying three players against one monster is better than two players against one monster, Mister Hefty Hands. <laughs> uh, <laughs> a two and a five. Uh, Dracos and Rania. Uh, Dracos is again the gold. Rania will be the red this time. Oh boy. <laughs> Man, sorry, Dracos. Does an eighteen get you? Oh. What? Yeah. What? I, I apologize. I wasn't listening. Eighteen get you? Yes. Ooh. An 11 on Rainia. 11 misses. Man, I'm just screwing, <laughs> screwing over the new guy. Fucking the new oh, guy over. Uh, again, you. I, again, you got lucky. Uh, five plus five. Ten hit points of damage. Oh. Okay. Uh, third and final round initiative. Oh, fucked. Guys. Oh, awesome. Uh, the... the, the 23. Not good enough. Uh, Dracos, what do you mean not good enough? 24. God damn it, it was a 19, too. <laughs> <laughs> Dracos, what'd you get on initiative? Uh, 13. 13. Oh, I want to say a lie and say it was 33. <laughs> I'm on a save. Uh, six and a one. So I'm going after Rainia and Ash or uh, Dracos again. Oh, I so wish I could. Dracos, do you want me to switch this up and you be red? No, I love gold. Okay. I love gold. Uh, this gold, time you might gold be member. Gold. My Billy was the key. <laughs> 21 to Radia and 14 what? to Dracos. You hit me. 14. He missed you. M missed missed, missed uh, the Draconic. I wish I had done. <laughs> Well, I'm not rolling for shit on uh, damage. Nine hit points to Rainia. Okay. And you are up, Rainia. All right. Two more attacks. Oh, are you freaking kidding me? Back to crappy rolls. That's going to be two misses because that's only a 10 for the high one. Uh, Rakos, you are up. Oh, wait. Am I supposed to tell you what one one? I'm not shooting, so I guess it does not matter as much. Did you roll a one? Yep. Uh, Reroll anything. Odds you hit Dracos, even you hit oh, yourself. Oh, God, I don't want to hit Dracos. Uh, uh, I want you to hit yourself. Yep. Uh, that's odds. That's Dracos. I just hit myself. Don't worry. I can take it. Do you think he's surprised by this? <laughs> Dracos, right, we're not going to let you not get hit again. I mean, come on. Bring it. It was you the second. So. Say bring it, bitch. <laughs> All right. Well, not, that word is not my vocabulary. <laughs> yeah. So that was that would have been the second <laughs> attack. So that is actually rather fortunate. So that's six points. 
Halved or full? Uh, what do you mean halved? Uh, friendly fires halved. Oh no, that's 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 full. So yeah, three. Three hit points, Dracos, and you are up. Thank God, it was only three. Oh, no, Kill this guy! I'm so yeah, sorry. friendly fuck ups. You always do your damage roll, but then you have it out. Ooh. All right, I don't think I've done any. I haven't actually. I missed. Did you roll one? A one. Yeah. Oh, no. one. Does he uh, hit me? Roll something odd. It's you hit yourself, even you hit Rania. With a anything. Come on, roll even. even it's it's a retribution. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Just even around. It's okay. Odd. You hit yourself. So do your damage and then have it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Boom to any chance you're gonna kill me because I'm bleeding well, out well, here. Well, no, you have you still have your follow-up attack too. Oh, okay. That's really bad. <laughs> yeah, so mine uh seven, so a three. So yes, round down. And then you had a second attack? Or a follow-up attack or no? I have a bonus attack. Asking, I don't know. Um what is uh, yes, I have a bonus attack of two uh, weapon fighting. Yeah, roll your D20. Yeah, go ahead and see if you hit me. Or roll another one. Share the eight. wealth. Eight, eight plus. Eight plus. Eight, I think. Eight plus eight. Eight plus. Yeah, eight. you get them. That it. How much yeah. damage? Uh, boom, boom D, you're still going to have to kill. Him. Nine. Nine. Ooh, almost got him. Go ahead, Boomda. One hit point left. Ooh. Oh. Uh, 13 to hit or no? Yeah, that gets okay. him. I kill him! Yeah! The Etten falls. There uh, he is. Let's <laughs> see. There he is. Adi falls at you. Even he falls away. Three. Uh, Dracos and Rania. Timber. Give me a dex check to make sure um, you keep out of the way of the That's fall. been going great tonight. Yeah, this is great. That's only an eight, so... That's fine. I just assume... Five or less. No. You oh. both managed to roll out of the way as the Etten falls right at the feet of Boomda, who steps on her <laughs> heads and declares that he has slain the beast. I did. I applaud. Thank what you. would you guys like to do? Loot him? <laughs> Looting the body! I will take straight up D20 who finds it. Lou. D20 straight up. Not going to be me. Nine. But I'll take a bad roll on that one. Nine. Nine, yes, nine, one. and what? One. Roll off. Nine, nine, one. Dracos and Boom to roll off. <laughs> <laughs> By the hairs of his chinny chin chin. <sighs> That's Wait, not his chin. <laughs> <Wait, laughs> uh, okay, Peter Griffin. If, do you want to turn it into a necklace? <laughs> you, uh, uh, Boomda, you oh. yank the leather bag out of Dracos's hand, and you find 200 gold pieces in old ingots. Uh, you aren't quite sure where it came from. Uh, but it looks like it's kind of old. Uh, I want a history, I want a history check. Okay, go ahead. Uh, Boomda, you also find a vial with pink fluid in it. I would like to drink that after I identify it. No. Oh, come on, drink it first. No, drink it, drink it. My history is a five. Oh yeah, it's gold. <laughs> I can I could try for S and G's, but. Oh, hey, actually, I might know what those are. That, that is a 22. Uh, it's from a, uh, it's from the Dwarven Mine. Oh, well, they don't, they're no longer in operation. This is totally worth it. That's, that's I true. off the cliff. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're halfway down the mountain. Hey, wait a minute. I'm fun, what? No, don't do that. <laughs> Money is irrelevant. So, but it's Shots. still gold. Are you going to identify the pink potion or no? Yes. Is that a ritual spell or right off the bat? Ritual. Ten minutes later, it's a potion of healing. You want to leave him in the dust? He doesn't he bad to ingots. He was too busy doing that. My potion that I got. Gosh, I don't need a potion of healing. I wonder if someone here could use a potion of healing. Wait, you didn't take any damage? 
No. He ran away. Oh, well, either one. I probably, probably our friend there can use it. I know I could use it. I don't know. I heard off screen that I've been abandoned. Actually, no, that would not be true. Be While separate. this is, excuse me. Go. While this is going on, I'm going to take my one healing potion from the start. And it's eight plus two. Ten. Ten. Good. I was trying to convince him to leave Kyle. Yeah. Do you well, want the healing on... potion again? I still have mine. Do you uh, Are you giving them Just took two hundred dollars in gold plus. Say you'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. There you go. <laughs> okay, you now have another potion of healing. Uh, the trail continues to descend into a more thick and lush woodlands. If you'd like to continue, I do. <laughs> Does it need some trimming? So you want, yeah, you want to go in the forest. You're, you're looking. No, it's in strips, so it's fine. Uh, the further you descend down the mountain, the more flora and fauna are starting to appear. Almost as if on cue, a large deer sprints from one copse of trees across your path. Everybody give me a perception check. Arm cannon. Natural 20 for a 17. Oh, wow. 13. A, a nine, but I also want to uh, attack this deer with my bow <laughs> in my favorite, my favorite terrain. Okay, uh, and uh, Boom, are you doing the arm cannon? It's gonna be nothing oh, left. Not. <laughs> okay, uh, Dracos, go ahead and see if you can down the deer as Boom does spots a cross or a arrow sticking out of its haunch, as does Rania. So 13 plus. Somebody's already marked that one. You're, you're I look around. 20, 21. Uh, 21. 21. 21. Yeah, you, you hit it. How much damage do you do? Eight. <clears throat> uh, not enough to down the deer. However, it is severely injured. Now it has... Uh, two arrows sticking out of its haunch. Rania and Boomda, with their perception skills, watch it run left to right, look back left, and they see a quartet of hobgoblins breaking yeah. out of the tree line. Boomda and Rania, initiative. Oh, Dracos, initiative <laughs> at disadvantage. Are they from Simon's Hollow? 11. That initiative, right? Both of them are ones. <laughs> Eighteen. Uh, that ties, Rania. I will let you go first. I don't want to go first. Oh, God. Uh, have they seen us? Yes. When they broke through, they saw the arrow shot by uh, Dracos and figured it out rather quickly. Gave it away. Where you go? Holding it. Uh, I think I'm going to hold action until somebody gets in melee with them or something, because I'm not going up there alone. Or they come to us. Uh, Actually, can I hide somewhere? Uh, any... not, where, not where you're currently at. You're in the middle of two copses of trees, so you can do yeah, this. Can I, then can, <laughs> I, can, I hide, can I hide behind like a tree to them? Can you hide what? Behind a tree, I have a move. I, I'll, I'll, maybe I'll do that this round. I'll move to behind a tree and make a stealth check. Uh, do you move 40 or better? Oh, uh, no, I move 30. Oh, so the trees are that far apart? Yeah, this is a cap. Oh, okay. Nope, I don't quite move that. I move 30. Okay, the four hobgoblins clear. Everybody's going to get a shot, shot at them. And number two. Sorry, Dracos. Nobody loves you. You're <laughs> getting two shot at you. <laughs> uh, honest to God, these are the dice. Fuck you, Frank. Run them. Uh, 14 and 17. Uh, 17 hits. 17 hits. Okay. Uh, on Boomda. Oh, I'm an idiot. I should have done it. Uh, 16, Boomda. On the spot. And Rania, no. 10. Nope. Yeah, that's not going to do it. Uh, 1d8 plus 1. Oh, 1. 2. 2 hit points to Dracos. 2 hit points to Boomda. Uh, next up is Boomda. 
I said, help, help, I'm being kidnapped. You're being repressed. I'm kidnapped. <laughs> Do it, Mbunda. Uh, 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 um, uh, I shoot him in the face with a crossbow. What about that cannon of yours? They're you know wearing what? It, it needs time to relax. relax. I can't just activate my cannon. We will oh, play for you people. I guess you need a little... He's not 18 anymore. <laughs> We're not 18 anymore. Uh, uh, AC on the Hobgoblins are 18. Okay, I got a 25, so I think that's okay. Yeah, I think you're fine. Okay. Uh, nine damage to the one who shot Dracos. Oh, okay. Because we're playing helpful tonight. I was going to say, he's, right. not, he's not listening to any of my advice. Last yeah. but not least, Dracos with the double crit failure. You are up. If you have a missile weapon, you can fire or you can close the gap. How close are they in accordance to each other? Oh, they're they're saying, coned out. You're, you're not in melee. I'm not in melee, but they how close in a proximity away how far away are they and how close are they together? Two and a half feet apart for each one. So how two, far and half, away? two and a half, two and a half, two and a half. They are thirty. How far feet. away? I have a horde breath for dragons of acid. 30, how, thirty-five how feet. Away? Thirty-five feet. It's out of range. So I'm going to use my terrain as favored forest, stealth around, and use my grapple to climb a tree. <laughs> what? <laughs> I love this idea. Uh, initiative, everybody. Wait, he can get stealth and I couldn't? Whoop, whoop, whoop. First natural 20 for me. Natural 20. I'm at 13. Uh, not 20, but a 21. 23. I'm at a 16. Uh, I'm not 20 with four, so 24. Uh, for my force, though. Yep. Uh, the extra one goes after five. Uh, Rainia will take two shots this time. We'll start with her. Are you sufficiently hidden? 18 and nine. Am I sufficiently hidden? You are not. They they watched you because they were shooting at you. Does the eighteen hit Urania? Yeah, that's what I said. Eighteen hits, nine misses. Okay. Uh, Boomda. Seven. Uh, I'm gonna give you uh, minus two to hit him, Dracos. Ooh, nineteen plus four minus two. So yeah, I still get you. Uh, they watch you scamper up the tree and they shoot at you. They shoot you in the arse. Oh, great. Another shit roll. Uh, four damage uh, to those of you that got hit. Rainia and Ashton, or Rainia and Dracos. And I have a, a 22 to hit. Oh, uh, then I get 19 plus four is 23. No, I did not get you. Never mind. Uh, so, Rainia, you just take it. No, 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 no. You take damage. Your your AC is only sixteen. Okay, he takes damage. Uh, <laughs> he's a, he's a, for his attack, I'm he's saying for my attack. Oh, okay. Yeah, hang on to that. We'll get to you. your your third. Uh, go no. ahead, Boomda. Uh, apparently, we're not standing and fighting, so I am also going to run into the trees and hide. Okay. Um, you know they're watching you because they're shooting at you. Hence, into the trees, where you can disappear. Also, I'm tiny. Yeah, there are bushes. You're made out of metal. You clank. Rainia, you're up. <laughs> um, well, that's what I want to do. And I realized something. I can move 30 as a dash. Then I can move I have up to 30 feet more as a bonus action, because I'm a freaking rogue. <coughs> so no one else moved up to them. So I'm not a rogue. I can do that. You're not that special. I said, I'm a rogue. I can do that. Or, I'm not a rogue. I can do that. You're not special. As a bonus? Yeah. There's no me and win, only an I. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, especially with this team. So are you uh, going to charge and get into melee with them? That's what I'm hearing, yeah. Do no, it. that's not what I said. 
So I went to the I heard. <laughs> and, well, clean the peanut butter out of your ears. Or and rub it on your balls. So basically, I'm going to make do. I'm going to use a dash as a normal move. Then I'm going to dash to try to get into some trees. And I want to freaking stealth. Are you going to go uh, the same direction Dracos and Boomda went or the other direction? Uh, further back. I envision them both going left. Come this way. Oh, God. You know what? Safety in numbers. I'll go that way. You, you hear the fighter yell out, come this way, as you notice uh, he's got a sparrow's nest on his head from trying to climb the tree. <laughs> I'm not going to climb the tree. I'm just going to try to hide Gilly. or to shoot them. Yeah. And I'll draw them. <laughs> All right. So, out. <laughs> oh, hey, so can I make a stealth when I get to the top of the tree since I do have enough wood to do it? Sure, go ahead. Oh. I disappear because that is uh, really good. That uh, is 26. Okay, fair enough. Uh, Dracos, you uh, are using your cover to try and cover Rainia's escape, and you hit with a 19. Um, I decided because prior or prior <coughs> knowledge, I'm uh -huh. going to use a spell as opposed to a attack. Okay. And I have um, Fog Cloud. Oh, welcome to the game, Neil. Okay. Which is, which is my last spell slot. Gotcha. And I cast that towards them and grouping us more together. Fair enough. That lasts, is it concentration or does it have a specific duration? I forgot. Concentration. concentration. Up to an hour. Up to an hour. Fair enough. Uh, any of you guys speak Hobgoblin? You do not. Probably not. Uh, Boomda, you here. Where'd they go? Where'd who go? Shitty Top Gun reference. Oh. <laughs> I, I need I need an older cast. Uh, okay. I think I'm old enough to be part of so, that. But uh, I'll always be your way. I'll always uh, uh, play volleyball with you, uh, boys. <laughs> Shut up, Sundown. Nobody's talking to you. Uh, Boomed in, Rania, you, or Rania, you notice that a fog descends right in the middle of the goddamn day, obscuring vision for everyone. Uh, Boomed in, you can hear the hobgoblins trying to figure out their next course of action, which is going to be retreat, is what you hear. Yes. They're coming at us. What Quick. a dick. We blow up the barrier. <laughs> Turn down the forest. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. They're running away. We're fine. Yeah. I was gonna in fact I, I was don't know where we're... Rania is, but at least you and I are fine. I'm right here, dum dum. Uh I can't hear you. you're too stealthy. That's right. Dracos, <laughs> do you lift the cover of fog or leave it for a while? Leave it. Um, after the hear of retreat and the sound of armor retreating, I do lift. Oh, give me an insight check, please. So, uh, seven. <laughs> you aren't sure when to dispel this, so you ask Boomda in a hushed voice, Is it okay? Hey, you guys, are you gone yet? Hey, you guys. <laughs> Baby Ruth. <laughs> I mean, we're all pineapple, right. Pineapple juice. We're all right there together, right? Well, what? you're you're stealthy, so nobody knows where the fuck you are. Well, I could still, I know where they are. And True. I can actually whisper, I'll go, hey, you know, why don't we just. A vicious creature <laughs> behind you is whispering. I say <laughs> shoot at it. <laughs> Oh, How about brat? <laughs> I mean, the cloud isn't going to follow you, right? So we could just leave. Well, if we walk where the wind is going, it can follow us. Or if Boomda breaks wind. <laughs> we can do that too. Uh, Dracos, the, take the, the call is yours. How long I do you want to leave? So I sit in silence and wait for a melancholy timing. Okay. 
Uh, you wait for what you consider to be a successful amount of time. You lift the fog cloud. Give me an insight check. After you get lost in the fog. Eight. But your favorite terrain is forest. You might and my favorite been. and my favorite terrain is a forest. So I feel at home. So you should have advanced. Uh, the fauna have not resumed. The flora is okay. Uh, no one sees any hobgoblins around. You, know, you, you should have had advantage. I should have had an advantage, I guess. Oh, yeah, I can hear him. He talks yeah. like he's at a coliseum. <laughs> so you, so you didn't <laughs> I didn't yeah. roll for an advantage. It, it doesn't matter. You, you had a high enough roll. You feel rather cognizant of it. I mean, you can re-roll to make yourself feel better. I don't care. No, I believe you. It make me feel better. <laughs> You're not playing. <laughs> I'm playing with myself. Uh, the deer, the deer is already taken off, wounded. Yeah, it's probably it's even a bunch of bloody holes. Oh yeah, you can you can go back to uh, hunt down the deer if you want. I'm an excellent tracker. Yeah, it's left a blood trail too. Or you yeah. can follow the trail down the mountain, Walton's Mountain. So I, uh, can I, may I uh, track the blood trail for a short period of time to see if it leads down towards the mountain? Sure. Go ahead and give me a roll. Yeah. I'll follow and have my crossbow at the ready to shoot. Natural, natural 18. Plus survival. Plus survival. Yeah. Uh, you find it just a scant 20 yards off the trail. Dead from blood loss. Damn. One hobgoblin arrow, one Dracos arrow. arrow. Dinner with yeah. with the trajectory of the deer. You, no, you found it. You found it. With the tra trajectory of the deer, I wish to follow, proceed down the mountain at a twenty foot pace off of the trail. So you found the, the the deer went across the trail. The trail goes down, so it's kind of doing this parallel. Yep. Okay. Or perpendicular. Perpendicular. Yeah. So I decide if you, I hate to be the, the new guy, but if you eat the food, does it give you health points? Mm. Um, no. no. I have to compare no. its leg to my leg to see if maybe I can <laughs> cut it off and use it as a new leg. Jo Joffrey, just, Joffrey Dimmer just sometimes, out of sometimes if you cook a meal, <laughs> you eat it. In some games, it does yeah. give you a small health point advantage. Video Let's find games. out. I eat the leg raw. Uh, raw, very nice. This is game two. This is game two. Uh, yep. Uh, Boom does gnawing on its haunch. Boom to give me a straight up D20 roll. Yeah, yeah, I I the That's an 11. It's delicious. My roll's an 18. He has AIDS for the rest of the game. Yeah, he's, oh. he's gonna he's gonna start losing weight as he gets a tapeworm. <laughs> you got I worms, have... dude. Uh, mm -hmm. Dracos, would you like to try and eat it? Because Boomda seems perfectly happy, although he is a goblin. I am. I start completely... sitting down and rubbing my ass on the ground as we go. Using, using my cook tools. <laughs> using my cook tools. Can I can I start a small campfire and fillet the rest of the Dear me. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Anybody want to tell them what's wrong with that idea? Or shall I have them roll? Um, go ahead. Go ahead and roll insight check, Dragos. Yeah, insight the GM. I'm just... Uh, um, small smoke a 13. Uh, your fire is going to start with a little bit of smoke. And you know there's hobgoblins in the area, so you aren't quite certain that now's a good time to do that. Oh, it's not wrong. You would surmise that maybe cutting off a hunk of meat and maybe cooking it at a more prudent time might be beneficial to your endeavors. Yeah. Prudent. All on a 13. I decide not to at all. There you go. Do you cut off a haunch or no? Cut a haunch. No, no, I don't need to wait. cut off two. If it's not going to bring if it's not going to bring hit points, then no. 
it no, but it will save not. off exhaustion, things like exhaustion and, and such. Yeah. I do have a day. I do. Ha I do have one day's worth of rations. Well, you did. <laughs> we don't anymore. No, we don't anymore. So, Even oh, without it. So uh, for us. yes. I'll, okay. So I will. I will slash a piece of meat and salt it. There you go. Yeah. Sea salt. You know what? Of course. <laughs> Well, I will. I will too. I, I only take enough for yourself. I'll take a. I'll take a piece for me. Well, you're awful bossy. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm being nice. Actually, you I, killed I, it. Take as much as you want. <laughs> Fuck her. <laughs> well, he's, too, he's concerned about carrying extra weight around. That's all. Oh, oh really? Weight. Anything wrong with his uh, physique that we want to go ahead and stress on? together maybe there's some kind of facial deformity that's pretty it's too much it's no, just too much sky rim I looked down like i don't see anything it was pretty good to me <laughs> fair enough so uh you guys each uh, carve off a haunch of meat boomda is still eating the leg and two haunches of meat for boomda uh do you want to head back down the trail so uh uh where you spotted the hobgoblins the trail splits. I will take uh, investigation rolls from all of you, please. Oh, okay. yeah. I do A that. Two roll. Yeah. Investigation. That's 25. All right. Seven. I'm supposed to ask if it's still forest. Still forest advantage. What was yours, Rania? I was not nearly a 25. Okay. <laughs> a seven. Dracos? Uh, natural 18 plus investigation Good plus enough. 5, 21 plus advantage. <coughs> Dracos gets the 5. Oh, interesting. Uh, so, Dracos, you find a, a stone overgrown by some grass. On the stone, it's chiseled to say Silas, and it is on the left trail. The middle trail is the one found by Boomda. It too is overcome with grass, and it says Hagen. Which one's bigger? <laughs> Hagen is the middle way. Arcana from all three of you. Arcana. That would be good. 22. Uh, 13. That's good. Eight. Uh, Dracos doesn't know what it is. Boomda and Rania, you know Hagen Wastes are the desert to the right of where you started. Boomda, your trail appears to lead towards that land. Uh, Dracos appears to go due east at this point. Is there any extra markings on the rock other than insignias or other than the words? Nope. Do they, so wait, there's three trails or two, three roads or two, three. three so we didn't find the third one. Did they Everybody look? At it? Everybody roll again. Cause I mean, we know, we know that the other two are marked. It stands the reason the third one is, I just missed it. Uh, not natural 20. A natural 17. Yeah, you guys are going to find it. I, I didn't roll awful that time, but 11. You guys find a third stone called 4B. Uh, I will take Arcana checks for 4B. <clears throat> nope, I have no idea. I think. Four. <laughs> Very uh, close. I think Kyle stepped away. Oh, or the cops got him. I didn't see if he was ordered to the ground. <laughs> so you have three trails. Uh, one is uh, Silas, which none of you would have any idea what that is. Second is Hagen, which is kind of the name of the Hagen Wastes. And the so third is Forby. And unless Boomda can come up with a good roll, you will not know what that is. I'm going to use the restroom real quick. Sure. I think I'll wait for Boomda to get back and make that roll before I make any decisions. I know I don't want the wastes. 
Yeah, it might be something really cool in the wasteland. Well, it probably is, but I'm looking for civilization right now to recover. Well, as far as you know, according to your map, the only civilization is west. He he did not mute his mic. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, if you take another short rest, you, can, you still have the rest of your head, guys. <laughs> so, so, in this short rest, the not a short rest, but in this time of waiting, I'm going to take my uh, last health potion from Boonda. Yep. D8 plus two. No ones. Two plus two, so four. Yep. Good rule. I like that. No it's one. A, it's a healthy roll. Yeah. Uh, Boom does not around. So, what do you two want to do? Uh, Rainia does not uh, want to go into the wasteland, but Silas seems to be going due east, which is not the last point of civilization that you so, guys are aware of. So, so I've lost. Uh, I've lost the, the ability to check my map. I've lost my map in the fog. You said, okay, so you said west was where civilization was. West so, is where you started on the other side of the waterway. You started in Peepo. So the third one that we did not make any checks on, or, or we're waiting for Boomda to come back. Uh, one, one is east. That's the one that one, Mike had Silas west. is east. Offered a gamble, offered a gamble with your the only thing that you know is uh, the third one, which is Forby, goes southwest whereas Hagen goes due south and Silas goes due east I mean my guess would be to take that one because it heads west yeah at least not, to start. Checking, not checking the map not being able to per se see the map I would do the Silas as well no no, well, Silas, no, no. She, so, she wants to go to Forby or, uh, yeah. Barbie's the one that goes west. Silas is the one that goes east. We came from the west direction. So, so you want to go east or south? She what wants to go there? southwest. I want to go southwest. As opposed to the not back where we came from, but. Well, what, what it is is you've come down the mountain and you've reached three choices. I can look at Silas. Up. Forby, which kind of angles this way, and this one goes due south, and that's Hagen. When, when Kyle gets back, ask him to describe Frank's uh, uh, direction. Uh, giving, uh, direction ability. There's always a sign, yeah. and it's always accurate, and these fuckers are just too stupid or, to understand it. But I don't know. I don't or know where you, or your mayhem. No, no, I'm right. I'm dead on. I know well, exactly what I'm talking mayhem. about. Mayhem. Turn, turn left now. Uh, yeah, fucking, fucking, uh, okay, cheat. Look at the map you sent us. Oh yeah, uh, that's not cheating. If you guys want to look at the map I sent you, that's fine. It's, yeah, yeah, like it's, I still, I still have no. Are we on the red that red road somewhere? Well, no, you have no trail on the section you're at. Oh. You are, you are just under the N in range, about oh. midway down in the mountains. So it would appear as though Silas is going to lead you into grasslands, whereas right. the other two routes take you through high mountains. Boomda, give me an investigation. <laughs> right nope. Okay. I want to go back towards water. Uh, that is a 19. Uh, Boomda, the third road that you found, Forby, is familiar to you as it was part of the Hagen Empire. <laughs> And it was a religious Mecca. Yeah, so we're going to the Hagen Waste, right? Well, that is, that is a point yeah. of contention because Rainia does not want to go through the wastes. Uh, Dracos kind of wants to hug the water and go back west where you guys started this. Wait, uh, wait. You said that way was east. Silas was east. Silas is east, but he said he wanted to hug the water. And that would Which be southwest. Well, I'm good, I'm good with that. I'm actually good. I was thinking we're coming from west. I'd like to go west. Yeah, so these three, these two want to go towards Forby, which is southwest, a uh, trail that leads southwest. Why don't we just swim across the water and then take the path we already know is safe? Too deep, too dangerous. Is one of, is one of your limbs like a propeller? 
No. <laughs> no, but he has motorboat proficiency. Well, I said if he is we a all. motorboat, then we can Show we all. <laughs> we could just ride him like a motorboat. We don't have to swim. Only have to swim. Mature audiences only, folks. <laughs> That's was that my best friend? Somebody has to be Harry Potter. It isn't us. My best friend with Harry Potter. Uh, yes. Boom, boom, <laughs> boom to has the, the game. So those are your choices. Due south into the Hagen Wastes. Uh, due east to Silas, whatever the fuck that is, because no Arcana check is going to tell you that. Or southwest towards this religious mecca, but at least it's taking you west. I'm going due west. Southwest. Got one due west, southwest, oh, two southwest. Sir, I'm not sure about this religious mecca, but okay. Boomda, hey, you've seen Planet of the Apes. You know what's waiting for you. <laughs> you should go to Silas, but I will certainly follow everyone else. I'll just follow a new guy. I know the way. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that has always ended well on Murder Hobo, Inc., the trail through the mountains has given you an eagle-eye view of the Bedlow Straits, the waterway that separates you. As you wind around the shale-covered peaks... Are they going to be straight? No. Nothing's ever continue straight. On. Always continue on. You continue stop on. to take in the majesty of your elevation, but a flapping noise is heard, and a uh, serpent-like form rises from below the cliff. Oh, it's covered in blue scales and appears to be about 14 feet long. Oh, come on. Everybody roll initiative. We just friggin' run away. It's a reptilian. It is a blue dragon wormling. 21. Do we have any time to rest in that huge long... How no, long but you... Dracos took uh, a healing potion and he his favored enemy is a dragon. So yes. Rainia and to fight it because that's a um that's a twenty-two for me. I only rolled a seven. Uh batting or plus is, initiative. Uh plus ten. You don't, yeah, you don't get plus thirteen, so uh Rainia Boombada the dragon and Dracos, that is the batting order. Rainia, you're up. As you sit there and look at the majesty of nature, <laughs> Roy Schneider and Blue Thunder comes up, and he's going to blow a hole in your head that you can sail a canoe through. But you're up first. All right, I'll ask, is there anywhere to hide? Nothing. No rocks, no nothing to get behind. You can make a leap if you'd like, but uh, these are shale-covered rocks and very, very sharp. Actually, I'm not going to get any advantage on this. Uh, I will say if you use your entire movement, you can probably run and dive behind something as long as you don't roll a one through three. On a T20? Yep. I'll do that, and then I want to try to shoot it, I guess. Uh, no, no, you'll only be able to get your movement oh, okay. on this fair, one. Fair, okay, so uh, that is not a one or a three. That is a I'm nine. going to try to talk to it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, you are th you're fourth up, so Boomda, what do you want to do? Also, I'm basically spreading out so that it, don't, it doesn't have all of us there to Gotcha. Go. Uh, I would like to do the same thing that Rainia wow. did and I find that rock with her. Okay. Uh, next up next up is the Draconis. Uh, not Dracona. It's me. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Uh, you hear the crackle, the fizzle, the sizzle, and a lightning bolt. Uh, lightning bolt. Dracos. It knits from its maw and goes right for the rocks at Rainia and Boomda. Both of you are able to roll at advantage because you have dove behind cover, but you'll still need a DC 12 versus Dex, or you're going to be feeling... Great. A save, save or check? Save. Save, okay. Save at advantage. Right. Dad, going to make that with a 17 on the deck. I'm gonna make that with these. <laughs> That's a twenty-three for me. Well, the one and a four. Oh! 
Uh, Boomda takes 27 hit points. Rania oh, takes... News. What? I'm going to cast a spell and uh, absorb what? elements. Uh, Rania, you take 13. I'm down. That's seven friggin' hit points. That doesn't really matter. How much are you going to absorb, Boomda? Uh, I only take half damage. Okay. Uh, so you take 13 as well. Mm -hmm. You see Rania get lit up like Vader by the Emperor. And she's, you know, I, even though I did make the check. She saves, uh, well, you still got to take half for uh, lightning damage. Uh, I was what, 15, right? Uncanny, do you have Uncanny Four. Dodge yet, Carol? 4D10. Huh? That's sixth level. No. Uh, I know I would do the hat take half. And I was like, no. I don't have it yet. You still took half. Well, yeah, more half on that. Uh, I got 20 hit points to start with. <laughs> hey, hey, it's a one shot. <laughs> Draconis, yeah. you're up. Uh, you've seen this thing potentially obliterate your two associates. What do you want to do? I'm Need to concur. Can I, can I try and talk to it and then in attack? Uh, probably not. <laughs> We're can I, can I, ah! Hey, nobody's hit it. Wait, did you For try the new guy, can I try and talk to an old friend from Dragonborn? And if not, attack. What is, what thing, Dragonborn thing, are you? Uh, acid. Copper. Copper. Copper? Copper. Copper? Uh, those two are mortal enemies, I believe. <laughs> oh, no. with, with those notes, I'm going to give my breath weapon, and that's a 2d6. Which one are you going to use? Your, your breath weapon is acid. 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 Uh, and it's a dex check. It's a dex check of 14. I rolled a 16, so I am safe. I will take half damage. So I roll a 22d6. Uh, 12. Nicely done. Uh, new round, everybody. Whew. 10. Not looking good. Roll initiative again. Initiative. Rainia? Uh, yeah, I know. I got to do it anyways. Uh, 18. Oh, that's one... That's one plus on the death save. Well, oh, oh, that's my. Are oh, you just gonna let me do that first? Yeah, well, because you oh, cool. you can't roll initiative, so. So well, I have a uh, roll my save, but that's that's. I'll take it. Yep. Go ahead. So I'll, I'll take a seven. Yeah, that ain't gonna be good. <laughs> <laughs> I rolled an eight. Uh, the ten. The ten wins initiative. Wow. <laughs> Uh, Boomda, you notice that Rainia is not moving. Would you like to bury her in a shallow that grave? Terrible. All right. But that wasn't me. I take a haunch from Rainia. <laughs> that is a terrible man. All right. I will uh, pop the potion, stick it in my arm cannon, and inject it directly into her. I knew you had it. I knew you had healing stuff. Are you going to blow the back of her head off? <laughs> I might. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how much does she get back? Eight. Mercy kill. Yeah. Eight? Eight back, Rania. Hold on, hold on. But then the arm cannon does uh, 16 damage. Well, what was the point? It was very close. I'm good. <laughs> Dumbass. Oh, no, wait, you obviously my... take eight healing back. Obviously, okay. not shooting you with a cannon. I was like, oh, what the fuck was the there with a crossbow? <laughs> all right, all right. I'm back. I'm good. Uh, uh, the dragon. Uh, uh, can well, I, by the way, after doing that, run and make it to some trees to hide? Oh, there are no fucking trees here. No fucking trees. Well, I'm actually rock. standing behind a rock right now. Yeah, you're you're on a cliffside filled with craggy rocks and an overlook uh, of the water. 
But if he puts it up, then there's a better chance that he won't come after both of us. Uh, the dragon is a wormling. It will attempt a bite on the only person it can. Uh, plus five. Uh, 13 get you, Draconis? No. Okay, you are up. So now we're in close proximity. Oh, yes, you are in melee distance. I have no idea of the hit points of this monster. Can you enlighten me? Sure, it's got a lot. <laughs> the health the health points of this monster. Uh, it, it, is, it has suffered 12 hit points. It is still flying, so it's above half. You got something you can nuke him with? That would be good right now. No, I'm brand Shut new. Up, level you're mostly four. dead. <laughs> I'm brand new level four, so I'm probably going to do a double dagger attack. Yep. With sure. Go ahead. The thing is, if you can keep him there, then I get sneak attack damage because. <sighs> Aren't you still unconscious? No. no. Two. I don't hit at all. I think you roll, roll both attacks. I rolled two, two, two twenties. And then I roll a two and an eight. Uh, nope, not even close. Eight, eight, New eight, round. Eight plus eight. Eight plus an advantage. No. Right. Eight, eight plus eight is 16. Still no. Okay. Oh, God. All right. 20, dirty 20. Uh, 22. Initiative? 16. Bye. Hey, Kyle, didn't you say you had to give the baby medicine, but screw it, that kid's going to live? <laughs> no, no, I gave it to him anally, just like it was described. Uh, Draconis, uh, what'd you roll for initiative? 40. 14. Uh, Rania, you're up. Uh, Ashton is currently engaged in melee with it. All right, I'm going to run up to it, and I'm going to take my, use my two weapons, and I can pull them as one action because I took that. Eat. As I run up, ooh, well, a seven... Plus, I don't think a 13 is going to hit, which would have been the second one, but the first attack is a 21. The first attack is going to hit. The second attack is going to miss because yep. you're starting to slip on the incline leading over the bay. So give me your damage before I make you roll your deck save. Oh. <laughs> oh, wait, I could have stepped <laughs> The dragon is here. Here's the cliff's edge. Okay. Right, but I couldn't have stepped around on the other side of the dragon. The dragon is hanging off the cliff, flying. Oh, I see, I see, I see. <laughs> see, this is when maps would help, but that's that's okay. Yeah, brain. Uh, all right, it's all right. Uh, hey, I'm not Scott. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Gee. Uh, seven. And Did you hear that? Four is eleven points of damage. And Scott oh, yeah. watches this show, so you know that's yeah. how it does. 23. Uh, what do you want me to make? Uh, dex check? Dex check, please. Save or check? Uh, save. I'll give you save. Yeah, that's only a 12. That's good enough. Uh, you slide right up to the very edge, and breathing heavily, you know that you're in deep shit danger. Uh, the dragon's turn is up. Odd, Dracos, even Rania. Well, I'm giving him a tiger. Five. Going for Dracos. Uh, Eight plus five is a 13, and that is a no-go. Uh, boom. Boomda, you are up. All right. I am, while I'm hiding behind the rock, I'm going to pop off my leg, toss it out, and this is another one of my cannons, and you it's going to shoot you, a dart. Huh? You do know that Rainia is on a precipice, right? Hey, hey, hey. It's not the arm cannon. It's the leg cannon. Okay. Woof, woof. And uh, you just hear a whirring sound, and it shoots a dart into Dracos, Rainia, and myself. And you guys get uh, six, seven, 10 temporary hit points. Nice. Very cool. And then I I'm going to hide back behind the rock. I knew, you know, I asked, asked like, because I wasn't sure much about alchemists. I go, can they heal before I decide to play? I'm an alchemist. I'm an artillist. 
Yeah, but still, you actually have more healing abilities. His name is Stella Artillist. <laughs> yeah. Love it. Uh, Dracos, you are up. You feel bolstered by the temporary hit points and feel ready to take on this draconic beast. Oh. At this point, I'm going to go with my double dagger attack. Come on, roll well this time. Who, who gave you the weapons? Those suck, man. Don't you have a sword? I, got a, a bow. I, have, a long, a bow. I have a plus one longbow. Okay, right. double dagger me. I'm surprised you didn't get like so I a. Two, I have two nines. Plus, plus eight. Plus eight. It's AC 18. Those are 17s. No oh. dice. No dice. Uh, probably last round of initiative. That would be nice. 16. 21. 22. Slow guy. Okay. 13. No, it's not. Pick up the pace. You're dragging us down. Hey. <laughs> 22. Rainia is up. Rainia, you're going to have to take half your movement to get off the precipice. Can I hit him first? Ye you know what? Yes, but if you fuck this up, you're going over and there's nothing I can do to save you. So uh, curse, wah, wah, wah. curse, curse. Don't roll a one. Roll a one. <laughs> well, wait, here's the question. Can I move off the precipice and still hit him, or have I got to actually do it this way to hit you, him? You can move back a step and then hit him. Okay, then that's what I'm going to do. Okay. Not yeah, you are not taking yourself out of range. Oh, yucky. Well, 12 is probably not going to hit him, but an 18? 18, Eight, 18 yes. is exactly what you need. I can sneak attack him once. I can so. I assume I can. Oh, six, uh, 12, 13, uh, 13, 13. Got it. Yep. Uh, next up is Boomda. Gonna pop <laughs> out of hiding and shoot him in the face with a crossbow. Do it. He's a jerk. Um, 20. Uh, so guys. eight damage, and then also I will have the um, uh, the leg cannon shoot everyone with a dart again, and you can take ah, twelve temporary hit points. Um, it doesn't stack, so you okay, choose so between the new stack. or the old. Oh, from, from, the so from ten to twelve. Two more. Give yourself two more. So from ten to twelve. You now have 12 hit points instead. So plus two. Yes. Now I'm at the equivalent of where I would normally be. <laughs> uh, okay, hold on. I'd like to take that back. Rainia gets no temporary hit points. Too <laughs> late. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the blue dragon uh, begins a tail spin and begins to <laughs> head straight down into the water. Uh, I will take perception check from Dracos and Rainia, who are the only two close to the precipice. Uh, not bad. 16? Do I get an advantage against my opponent? Also, do we get a reaction because he's moving out of combat to hit him? No, because the uh, proximity to the edge of the cliff is too close, so he's just like, whoop, straight down. He's in melee. Yeah. Yeah. No Melee dice. range. What was your uh, check? Uh, uh, 15 plus, plus four, <clears throat> maybe in an advantage. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Uh, you guys see him drop below cover using his movement. You look over the side, but he's not there. No splash or anything? No splash. Is there an is there a, a undercliff? Not from what you can see, but the cliff starts here and then slowly slices off down. So there is a drop that you would not be able to see. I will take insight checks from both of you. Sure. Nah, not from me. That's like yeah, it's only a two. Yeah, that's not 
to it's like four, a 16. Ooh. You would surmise that there are probably caves on this cliff somewhere, and maybe your opponent has ducked into one of them. I guess that. I, can't, I know more than my character. But at any rate, there ain't no blue dragon no more. Let's get the hell out of here. I hop over to my leg to reattach it. Oh, yeah. Tally okay. ho. Dex check. Make sure you don't roll a one. Or you might find the blue dragon can I, again. Can I 22. Use them? I'm natural 20. He uh, he manages to scamper over and reattach his leg without falling over. Would you guys like oh, to yeah. continue down the trail? Yes. Yep. Uh, That's the only option we have, right? Well, you can wander around the mountains if you want. Well, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a sharp to a trail plus water. Correct. Yeah. Yep. Uh, you go another two hours. It's late afternoon because fuck it. I don't put distances on my maps. Uh, <laughs> and you come to a spot where you overlook the great uh, Hagen wasteland. Uh, you are on a small plateau. The trail <laughs> goes down further. Uh, and all of the sudden, some son of a bitch shoots an arrow at you. Damn it. How long do those temporary hit points last? Oh, that is it, a question. It would have been an hour, <laughs> so they would have been gone. Two yeah, hours later. Can get a short rest at some you point? Minus 12. If, so you take 12. if you wanted to take a short rest an hour into your way, that would be fine. Yeah, like, yeah, I don't want to be like, where the dragon is, but I, you know, little distance. Where's the sunset? How far away from sunset? Yeah. Uh, if you take the short rest, you'll be right around meal time. If you don't, uh, it'll be about three, four o'clock. Before, just before daybreak. Yeah. I would ask for a long rest. As yeah. A new guy. I don't rest. Even, Set up, he says you rest. Pla plateau behind us. Slow. A plateau in front of it, you. No, it's a down incline to the town. Yeah, well, you're on a plateau. There's a down incline. Forward. Uh, and then you're in the wastelands. But the, the, the incline is forward and the plateau is behind us. So we have high ground. You have high ground. You are on the plateau at this point. I would, I would suggest to the group... A long rest. I think that's an excellent suggestion. As a new guy. Okay. You know what? New guy or old player, I think, um, I mean, I'm at eight hit points. So honestly, uh, no, that's not a bad suggestion. I was going to do short rest because at least I could recover some. But uh, uh, New guy can roll a d12 against me. Oh. Um, by the way, we still have the temporary hit points until we finish a long rest. Yeah, the one with the 12 oh, on it. Yeah. That's what I asked. Do we still have them or not? Yeah, no, I was confirming. It's been a while since I've played. Okay, okay. So we do still have them. Excellent. Yeah, being, being fair, I only wrote a four. Okay. So you guys are taking a break. You're taking your long rest. Like to push them off the cliff. Nice. Oh, wait, sorry. I'd like to Okay, wait. Hillary. <laughs> it's 9.38. We've got to wait 10 minutes before you do that. Uh, you wake up refreshed. However, because you've done a long rest, it's eight hours. Uh, the moon has risen, and it is a... So hit long rest. It is a full moon, so you guys are able to see. Yes, yeah, so you have had your full rest. Your hit points are restored. Oh, and, good. And your uh, spells have been restored. Yay! No hit points anymore. Uh, as you wake up, it is dark. The full moon is out, so you will have decent visibility. The right. Incline leads down into sand dunes. Um. So you may continue if you want. There are any Tuscan raiders. The decline. <laughs> can't tell. They're walking. The decline because we're on the high ground. Decline heads into the sand dunes. Mm -hmm. Just perception check. Decline. 
High ground I'm decline. Arguing semantics. I am arguing semantics right now. I just need to know because I'm. <laughs> and FNG, FNGs. You're here. There's the incline. Here's the dunes. Okay. See, see classy map. Scott, yeah, if you're great. watching, fuck you. This is a classy map. <laughs> I'm a visual learner. <laughs> <laughs> i'll keep that I'll, I'll say that one when blake checks it in there you go uh okay. so yes you have high ground you will take the descent the decline and then you will be in sand dunes all right we go then is that what you're doing yeah uh, that's uh, yeah if we can see and we are, we have had our long rest yeah investigation check yeah Ooh, 22. Uh, I know. I know you've been drinking. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, somebody got way, I got way higher than my 10, so. I'm not going to tell you about my investigation, though. I got an 11. Is it a minus number? Is it a negative number? No. He, he got high enough. Uh, you find a, what would we, we would call a mile marker. Oh. And you notice a mile marker ahead of you. Uh, on a high sand dune. <coughs> like two mile markers or just the one? Ooh. What do they say? I'm not telling you. They don't say shit. <laughs> it's face down at a three-way fork in the road. <laughs> <laughs> and I am pervy to hobo symbolism with my uncommon language. Okay. Uh, the sand dunes have worn pervy? whatever writing <laughs> off. Yes, he's pervy. Pervy. Purview. Okay. <laughs> Uh, yes, the, the words have long been erased by the swirling sands, but they're close enough. You can keep a fair eye on them. So they apparently lead to this, uh, Forby place or whatever. Let's go. The old religious place. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you follow it for a couple of miles. You reach the high point of a sand dune. And the pitted stone markers have guided you through the shifting sands to what is a crater in the Hagen Wastes. Rising towards another marker, you overlook the crater and observe the remains of a once thriving metropolis. Skeletal stone blocks show where lines of buildings once stood, and an obelisk rises out of the center of the city. A light from the moon shines off the center of one of these sides. I wish, to check the, I wish to check the symbolism of the obelisk. You will have to go down there and go look at it. I so, do. I so like the, it's not a city. the base of the obelisk. Well, it's in the middle of the city? Yeah. Yes. I'm up for it. Well, well okay. Before I do that, how many, how many lights before daybreak? How many lanterns before daylight? Daybreak. It, it, it's, it's about like... Uh, Four. No, it's about like it's about ten p.m. Ten? Not what time is it? About ten p.m. He's right. Oh, ten p.m. Yeah. So um, from I'm where right. we are, Frank said it. I'm right. Hurrah! <laughs> so from where we are, we see how much movement in the town. Oh, oh, Perception, oh, Rania. What were you doing? I was. That's what I was curious. Is this a town where actually people are living, or is it like a ghost town? Perception. And Sixteen. Um, That's mine. That's only a nine. 21. Uh, Dracos and Boomda, there ain't shit moving down there. There's no roofs on any of these buildings. Uh, would appear to be a dead city. With my. Except for this weird light on the obelisk. Undead, natural explorer. But I can sense the celestial. Oh, you, oh, you want to do prim primeval awareness? Primeval awareness. Yeah. No one dead. No one dead. Well, no, tell them all everything. Thank God it's not a necropolis. <coughs> yes, that would so, be bad. I guess I'm supposed to tell you everything for primeval awareness. It's uh, undead. What was it? Help I know. Out. Yeah, I, I got it. He, he got it. Yeah, yeah none, none of that shit's there. None of that junk. Okay, so I wish to go down there and check the obelisk. Uh, Boomda and Dracus are going down there. Rainier, are you going with? Yep. yep. All three of you reach the center square with Paul Lind, and you find this obelisk, which has seen better days, 
covered in sigils, <laughs> directly about eight feet high, is a gemstone scratched from the swirling sands. It appears to be a tiger eye about yay fucking big. And that I'm is like, what the moonlight okay. is ricocheting off. Oh my God, I'm drooling at that. I wish I would to, like to knock the obelisk over and then collect the eye. But before but that, I'll I wish wait for to, the new guy. But before <laughs> that, I wish to uh, see where it is pointing at a. <clears throat> Ooh. <laughs> he thinks he's Indiana Jones, like it's gonna point to a map where it shines. Which way the light shines at noon? Unfortunately, at noon. your staff is only six foot tall. You need it to be six <laughs> foot four inches. That's not what she said. <laughs> <laughs> she lied. <laughs> uh, Which way is the the tiger east west? The gym. It's facing. You're coming from the north. north. Okay, north. but it, and, it, and it's a triangle. An obelisk is a triangle at the top. Four sides. Not the top. It's a triangle. No, no, it's a, it's a, it's a pyramid at the top. Pyramid. A pyramid. Yeah, so but the side. stone is only eight foot off the ground. Which way does the eye face? It's facing north, where you guys came from. However, or south, as you do this, there are stones. On all four sides. Oh. No. All, right. well, all of them are about yay big. They are scratched up by the sands, but they're still going to fetch. Uh, so I, so I, uh, awareness check for traps before boom <coughs> delay sh shoves it down. Yeah. So can, we, can I make a check too? Sure, go ahead. Everybody make a check. I don't care. You guys are all fine. 22? See if there's any traps on this thing. Okay, 22. What's my, what, plus what? Slide of hand. Well, wait, slide of hand isn't for traps, sir. That's higher. That's actually higher than 22. That's 24. I'm only out of 12. Uh -huh. Boom, are you uh, waiting with your boomstick or what are you doing? Uh, Archer is ready. Yeah, can I make some calculations? Like if I blast it at this corner, it falls this way. Sure. And then also keep in mind where my partners are located around there. So that you drop it on them? What? No, no. Don't. Or, hold on. Let me check Zoom like. chat to make sure. Pre warned. <laughs> okay, so you're doing that. Uh, Rania and Dracus, uh, you do not sense any traps on this thing. All right, so I'm going to back way the heck off. So depending yes. on this thing falls, I don't want it falling on me. And I back as well. A little bit of trust, guys. I like a little boom, bit of boom, trust. Boom, that was going in the, the cave. Trap that was going in the cave. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sorry. Trust, my trust is very, um, <clears throat> I don't have a lot of trust <laughs> right now because of the cave. Boom, very, there, it looks very, like it was uh, expensive. backed off. As I said, when I back off, then I'll, you know, well, if I notice, hey, as soon as we're both clear, I'll Archers like, ready! <laughs> yeah, I move, yeah, Age of Empire, but I move at least 12 foot back on a six foot obelisk. That, uh, the obelisk is 12 feet tall. These gemstones are at the eight foot mark. Then I move at least 13 feet. <laughs> yep. I would like to move 20 feet back <laughs> behind them. You're shooting. Right? Fire the arm cannon. Yeah, so you're good. How much damage does it do? Uh, in this case, it does 11. You've chipped it rather substantially, but it doesn't keel over. I fire again. Okay. Uh, 10 more. That's enough to cripple it, and it's going to fall uh, back and to the left. So it falls west. Exactly as I pointed, because we're heading west. And so we'll go we're heading, up and go west. We're heading south from the north, where it was pointing. Well, we're trying to go west at some point. I thought I would help you point that direction out. 
<laughs> That's what I've been screaming this whole time, towards the water. <laughs> so you guys are all going west now? Yeah, but before that, I'm going to pry out or help pry out the uh, tiger's eyes, all the gems. As, as well as I am with my double daggers for boom delay. Okay, you guys are going to pry out the one on top. Go ahead and give me a performance check. Performance. Can I use uh, smith tools or tinker tools to pry them out? Yeah, well, sure. thieves tools work. You guys are all going for the one on the top, right? No, I'm going for the, I was prying the, I'm prying the tiger eye. They're all, all four tiger eyes. Eight foot. Well, now it's on its, now it's, flat so oh yeah i see the issue now so, knocking it over now if you want Mitch you asked, can each pry out a different stone i'm fine with that strangely enough okay i'm going mid shaft with a 23 <laughs> hey uh can i do that as a thieves tools check to pry it out sure are you prying out the same one as draconis or a different one i can do a different one uh okay. that would be so fine that's 20 Boomda. Clearly a different one than the other two. Outstanding idea. Uh, as, so. We don't want to be here all day. As each of you goes ahead and uses your specific <laughs> weapons to pry it out, each gemstone pops off mostly intact. However, <laughs> as the gemstone pops off the pillar, a gasp of air escapes with it and forms up into a cyclone. You each released the uh, three deadly sins, which is a deadly encounter, and each one of you has one of them. I would so like to push the, the obelisk over and release the fourth one. <laughs> oh, don't! Can we just run? Oh yeah, you can run. I don't care. I'll I'll take my opportunity attack. Good job. Try and fuck you guys up, but uh, let it be let it be known that I gave you. Multiple opportunities to attack the same gems. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and before any of us run, because we are headed due west or whatever the it fell tour, I'm going to smash a fog cloud spell. Knowingly that we're all headed due west. Anybody want to let them know what the problem there is? <laughs> what kind of elemental is it? Air. <laughs> The oh. one that whirls around and blows things around? Yeah. That's just going to make it bigger, right? No, yeah, no. Sure. What I'm saying is it's not going to it's not going to affect it. And it uh, can just matter. basically blow the part right away. By the way, I have disengaged, so you do not get an attack of opportunity if I friggin' run away. I'll just hunt you down because my speed is much faster. However, since it is close to 10 o'clock and you three dumb shits have released not one, not two, but three deadly encounters upon yourself, we will go ahead and absorb the shame and go right to what you thought about it. So we'll start with new guy, Ashton. Uh, Recap the whole thing? Like we're all dead now? Yeah, we'll, we'll, go ahead and, we'll go ahead and say that we aren't sure what happened. It's like a shitty okay. movie. The Hold on, guys. Everyone on. roll a D12. <laughs> how we do. <laughs> My bad. If I would have known that uh, Boom Delay was going to go to for a different stone, I would not have gone for a different stone. I would have gone for the same one and tried to help him with his and get my stone back. I believe the get my gold. Quite get my specific. gold back. <laughs> get my gold back with his stone intact. <laughs> so, Ashton, uh, since this has been your entire second trip to Dungeons and Dragons, what did you think? Yeah. Um, I'm coming back. Okay. Yay! Have, we'll, we'll, hey, but if you'll have me, we, we I think we'll have you because they didn't get the key. Prudence can play, though, right? Yes. Yes, Prudence yeah, can play. You guys can team up. Might be a little more fun. Uh, yeah, maybe. Not sure. And don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. Regina was awesome. It's pronounced Regina. 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 I've been... <laughs> Regina. But, but 
there there is power in numbers and i will be back this is uh, my second game i've ever played and you got to fight a dragon dude acid, acid doesn't always win <laughs> acid does not always win especially when you're overmatched by the dm who's fucking you over uh kyle what'd if, you think of the if, uh, if i may uh, excuse me yeah, but if sure. i may i have uh, listen Man, new guy's me. pushy. You guys notice that? Really? <laughs> so really pushy. But pushy. I've listened to at least I've listened to over 20 games with you, Frank, as a DM. And I was totally I was totally because I've been here when Prudence and them played with all their fanatics. I have I was so comfortable coming into this with you being the DM. Well that's that's what we like to hear because you know we, we were gonna fuck with you, but you know what? Why bother? That's is, that's Dewey's I, problem, I, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> and, hey, uh, and, and and thank you for your time. Hey, no, we're we're glad thank to have you. For, you. We we, thank we you enjoyed for taking your time with me. Every everybody is new at some point in time, and any DM who treats you like shit because you're new is a crappy DM. Uh, Literally, this is like our this is our three of ever playing Dungeons and Dragons. I've played. Skyrim, I've played PlayStation, Xbox, video games, yes, but this is literally hour three of ever playing D. Get his cock out of your mouth. You're not sucking it back. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, his fantasy, not mine. Ah, uh, uh, the love. Well, we're glad you had a good time. But hey, so. Frank, honestly, thank you. Thank you for having me. Thank you for coming. That's that's not a problem. Dewey, what do you think? Or Dewey. Dewey. Wow. Kyle. Dewey. Kyle, whatever. <laughs> Well, you know, I, I have to agree with him. It's a good DM who doesn't torture his new players by throwing acid in their face and permanently scarring their brand <laughs> new characters or throwing them to the wolves to be bled out to summon demons later on. You're a great DM. <laughs> Go back. Let's drop his stuff. Love <laughs> his stuff, boys. <laughs> Last but not least, Carol, what would you think of the scenario? Oh, it was fun. It was fun and it was challenging, which I was hoping for. Uh, although starting at eight hit points, ouch! Yeah. Uh, I and I was you, like, Carol. behind Carol, eight, almost... did you know that we were doing full, full half, and then roll hit points? I knew. No, no it's it's the automatic. <laughs> it's whatever. It's what automatically <laughs> comes up on. D and I'm a rogue, so you don't get a ton of hit points. Le level one and two, you're always at max. Level three, you're always at least half. Oh, and then fourth yeah. is your regular. By, it's whatever. By partisan, I ended with the full hit points I started with. Yeah, and three arrow, arrow elementals hunting your ass down. <laughs> but yeah, fair we, enough. we all did. We all were full. Thanks, Boondalay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's that's all right. I said, I, I just, you know... It's D and D Beyond, so it's whatever's programmed into it. Well, I, I, I guess I, I wanted to make it challenging from the get go. I liked it. I really add, liked it, though. You still have to add in your rolled hit points. Yeah, you can always adjust on even on D and D uh, Beyond. No, I don't. Think I, have, I believe I have it set for auto. It auto does the hit points. I, it doesn't. You don't roll anymore. Hey, uh, Carol, they've got this thing. It's called paper and pen. Yeah, and, I, <laughs> and you just cheat that way. Yeah, but, you know, we get this wonderful technology. I'm Bo honest. Boomda had 87 hit points to start at fourth level. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I yes. also said I'm a rogue, but only, uh, I do have a plus one in my con. So. But regardless of that, uh, Ashton, you did awesome considering I said this was tough. You did really awesome. You rolled up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Teacher fair enough. Cohorts. Because because my first go around, he made some silly, stupid. I had I'm like ah, uh, I don't know what to do in this situation. Well, have you seen his scenarios that he runs? He sucks. He's horrible at it. He, <laughs> he's really bad. <laughs> it's it's just right now. Is he gonna go? You're gonna make him watch one that I ran. <laughs> <laughs> and and yeah. I'm bad. I'm but bad. he's not much. He's not as much of a dick when he runs his own as when he's playing with y'all. Shock. That, that is the stick. That is the stick that we do. Yeah, that 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 is that is the mark of a good DM. They take their time with new players. They introduce them. Sure, you're probably gonna fucking die, but you know what? At least maybe you learned something. It so. literally took us two and a half hours to create my character because I was so into it. Like I'm like, can I do this? What is what with this? That's my skills. 
I, I got uncommon. What does that mean? Can I ask this? Can I ask for this? Can I ask for that? I'm dragonborn, dragons, scales, da da da. And you know what? Blake was amazing with that. Hey, yeah. whoa, 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 whoa. There's only so much room at your place that has. Look, so if you had two and a half hours, if you had two and a half hours to sit down and just be, be between me and you and to, to literally make one single character. For the, a new guy for the first time to give him the full advantage. Well, we were drinking a lot too. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing new. <laughs> what is that? Oh yeah, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> give, 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 give him, give him, give him the Donald Duck, Brian. I have no sex skills, right? I. You know skills. what? Yeah. Production skills. <laughs> Esmeralda does not like me. <laughs> 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 My Esmeralda tried to buy me a drink, notch. and I Esmeralda tried to buy me a drink, and I poured it on the floor. Oh, uh, see, we, we're so hobos do not always get alcohol ever. Yeah, that's not what we do. Yeah, uh, yeah. Somehow that didn't go well. That's right. So, folks, uh, once again, thank you for joining us. We appreciate your time. We hope you enjoyed it as much as uh, we did. Uh, like Ashton, if you want a seat at our table, let us know. We'll, we'd love to have you here. Uh, don't forget to follow us on Twitch. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter. Take a look at the YouTube channel if you want to buy stupid crap like that. Also, some designs by Carol. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Tiny, you are. <laughs> yes, Kyle's Carol, getting naked. Carol, just one question. I, yeah. am, I am Murder Hobo Inc., yes? Yes. You are what? Murder Hobo Inc. You heard it here. You, you have. You have Quasi survived. <laughs> he says, "Welcome to the game." Welcome to the. Oh yeah, Scott. We did not think Scott was coming back. <laughs> I'll be back. Uh, everybody, let's give the camera a wave. We'll uh, let the producer kill us off. Your mother sucks, Scott. Now there it is. That's what. We